It's actually quite heavy. Yeah, I believe it's the uh, robot vacuum. Yeah, so TPA actually recently just joined the robot vacuum uh, market. Yeah, so we'll be unboxing this package and we'll show you what's inside. Let's go! So now we have all the uh, items taken out from the box. Uh, we'll now attempt to set the robot vacuum up and then place the auto empty dock as well. So let's go! Alright, so I've plugged the uh, vacuum cleaner at the corner of the room. So uh, we'll let it charge. So it requires four hours for the first charge. We will use this room as the uh, testing room. So I'll throw a few like grains of rice or something like on the floor to see how the vacuum cleaner picks up the uh, rubbish on the floor. And I'll also test the mopping feature. So yeah, see you guys in a bit. Okay, alright, so I've updated the firmware already, so I'm gonna click on start mapping so that you can map the bedroom. Uh, I'll let him map the entire house themselves, but I'll just map the bedroom for now, so I'll press start mapping. And start mapping. Start quickly off the map. Alright, so I'm gonna get out of the way now. Bye! Alright, so as you can see on the screen, uh, the vacuum cleaner met the room already. I will now be filming the vacuum cleaner cleaning the entire room. Like, it goes one round around the room. Lah. So, see you guys in a bit.
centre square area. So basically this whole room. So yeah, I'm gonna take down this camera now. <laughs> Alright, so uh, I have a cup of like mixture of uh, rice and some spaghetti. Uh, they don't have any green beans or red beans and this kind of stuff, so uh, I shall just make do with what they have. Uh, I'll be pouring it within like this section here. So basically on the app, right, I can set the vacuum cleaner to clean a certain area and they call it the zone so basically I'll pour that lah. then you will clean within this from this wall towards that wall there yeah so I'm just gonna pour it now Whee! oh my god yeah so actually honestly it's not really that obvious but I'll try my best to film it so let me just spread it around okay I think this should be sufficient so you can see the greens there yeah so I'm gonna start the vacuum so stand by all right so here's the app uh, as you can see I have really like catered the zone so this is the zone thing that I was talking about so the vacuum cleaner will only move within this particular area so let's start Alright, so after cleaning, I actually took out the dustbin from the uh, vacuum cleaner. So this is the result. So this is what uh, the vacuum cleaner collected. And this is the leftovers uh, after sweeping around. So honestly, it's very impressive considering the suction mode is at its standard uh, power. So now I'll be pouring everything back out again and I'll be running it in full power. So let's go! Alright, so I took out the bin and this is what it collected and this is how much left so it's way way lesser and I mean uh, observing the thing running right the robot vacuum the side brush actually sweep like most of it away so it actually kind of went out of the zone but uh, as a matter of fact what matters most is that you know it got most of it which it pretty much did that's great so this is actually a very solid uh, robot vacuum cleaner. I'm super impressed by it. Maybe to show you guys how the bin is detached from the base itself. So this is actually the water tank. And this is where you fill the water in. But the bin is actually a separate component by itself. So just need to slot it back. So this is how it looks like as one attachment. Then you just have to slot it right underneath the vacuum cleaner so right here yeah so it's that simple and it's super easy to take out so, so you just need to click the button and pull it up alright so now I'm going to show you guys the how the auto dust bin will suck the dust from the vacuum cleaner into the dust bag so on the app I just need to click on this button then I'll press start now Alright, so that's the sound of the uh, dustbin sucking the dust from the vacuum cleaner. It's actually quite loud, but because we're in an echo room, so I think the, the sound is even louder. But yeah, I'm gonna show you guys the uh, bag and it's uh, the spaghetti and the rice that's inside. So let me pop the top. All the dust are actually inside. And so you know what, maybe I'll just pour everything. So as you can see, yeah, 
So it's actually very good. I really love this like auto uh, bin. It really helps you and it's supposed to last you a few few months with the dust collector inside and after which you will then replace a new bag. But yeah, it would definitely save the hassle of you cleaning the clearing the dust in the robot itself. Right, so that's the oh wow, you see, super clean. So basically the the bin really did suck up all the dust that's inside the uh robot vacuums bin. Uh. Yeah. Wow, I'm really very impressed by it. Alright, so I filled the uh, tank with water as you can see. So let me put everything back together. Alright, so similar to the vacuum test, uh, I'll be using the same area. Then I'll be pouring this uh, Cylon tea from the authentic tea house. So I'll pour a few drips on the floor to see how effective the mopping is. So let's pour a few. Yeah. I hope my sister-in-law don't kill me for this. Alright, okay, that's one drip. And maybe one in the corner here. And uh, let's see one more here. Alright, oh shit, there's a lot. <laughs> okay, so these three spots, and I'll place the camera here to feel the entire process. So let's go! Alright, so the mop, the vacuum really did a good job. So uh, you cannot really tell, but it's actually wet. Like there are streaks of water. And yeah, it's definitely clean. I mean, the three spots that we placed the drink at is definitely gone. And so far, there isn't, I never noticed any like super wet patch. Yeah, so it's all very nice and like just nice uh, so it just runs over it and it's like a quick mop kind of session so i mean definitely if you want like a very uh, simple mop then yes you can definitely use the vacuum cleaner mop feature but if you're looking for like those deep cleaning kind uh, i will definitely not use the robot vacuum one as it's very minimal and there isn't any like pressure on it Alright, so we've come to the end of this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And once again, thank you TP Link for sending us this robot vacuum to review. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!